Hey, thanks, buddy, for reviewing the beanie for me. You're the greatest. When you're done with it, could you ship it over to Dylan for me so he can review it? Thanks. I'm keeping this. Dude didn't even get my name right calling me buddy. Ain't nobody out here calling no buddy. So we ain't doing this. Say guys, what's happening? Simply Mike here for the definitive yo yo. And today, we're looking at something that's up and coming. Today's yo-yo is the beanie, a product of Throwing Sideways and Friends and Mr. William Guy. So this little beauty is the beanie. And this is Mr. William Guy. His YouTube channel is called Throwing Sideways and it's been making quite the splash. He's been doing yo-yo features, tutorials, and he's had guest appearances, like myself. And I was so excited when he had me on. He said he loved me being on his show, but I haven't been asked back. But here we are. The beanie. Now, in some of these shots, it looks particularly purple, but it's not. It's more of a blue, purple, steely hybrid. I don't know why it comes up very purple in some shots, but in person, it looks a little different. Despite the color variations, the first thing you'll notice is that this thing is exceedingly comfortable. When William reached out to me and started showing me pictures of it, my first thought was that it looked like a cross between the Recognition and an ND. But we'll get into that a little later. Another aspect to know about this yo-yo is that you need to have eyes like a hawk and keep on the watch for it because this is a pre-order. Most of the pre-orders have already been claimed, but William did say that there would be another run if this proves successful which it initially looks like it has and now a comparison or two yeah so look at all this business the original cognition gave way to the monometal recognition replacing the steel with a bigger beefier rounded over ram for comfort and as we descend into the gap we have cuts we have angles we have facets what comes together is a tightly wound, compact little powerhouse. Our beanie has a rounded over beefy rims as well, and they do add significant power to the spin. But as we descend into the gap instead of facets and angles, we got smooth. This thing is all the way comfortable. And that finish is frosty to the last. Eagle eyed viewers, We'll get to this another time. For simplicity's sake, let's say there's two types of budget yo-yos. Budget being about 50 bucks or less. In the first category, we have the entry level, which has some notable performance deficiencies. Inferior design, inferior materials, or just inferior play style in general like being clunky on a string or having more vibe than what you're comfortable with a novice player wouldn't even notice the type 2 budget yo-yo is the pro level it has a refined play profile the recog the cadence the sk the ultimatum and the memento play in that field so where does our beanie fit in in the equation well, this is definitely that second type. The professional level with that refined play style that we were talking about. And now that we're into it, let's check the specs. If you're a fan of any of the yo-yos that I mentioned, like the Recog, Indie Ultra, or the Ultimatum, then you should feel right at home with this yo-yo. 
especially with that sweet spot of 65 grams. But the burning question is how does it play? Well, there's four or five attributes that are must-haves when you have a good yo-yo. They are, you gotta have spin, power, balance. It has to be catchable. And comfortable is a little arguable, but for this yo-yo and for all of these attributes, you do not have to sacrifice at all. As a matter of fact, the yo-yo makes you wanna linger on tricks, linger in play, because it is just that easy to operate and a true joy to maneuver and hold in the hand. But right about now, we have a player spotlight. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, this is Mr. Chris Hernandez from Baldwin Park, Los Angeles. His favorite yo-yo is the Iceberg. And this is his contact information, which includes Instagram, YouTube, and TikTok. But I'm going to tell you one time, Chris, you got to lead a fancy edit into the professionals. <laughs> I'm just playing. Not a bad dude. He was real cool. And congratulations to our giveaway winner, Mr. Bruce Davis of King Sport, Tennessee. Hope you enjoy it. But check out what we get into for next time. I've got a long way to go before I get to this level. But I do have some fan mail. And you'll never guess what it is. <laughs> now, I finally got an MMC. Shout out to Anthony Opalek, originally from Brooklyn. So we're going to have a look at the Mark Mark Classic in our next video. And spoilers, it's noise. <laughs> this has been The Beanie Review, a production of William Guy and Friends at Throwing Sideways. I'm Simply Mike, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.